everybody welcome back to another episode um, as you see doing things a little bit different today <laughs> you're probably wondering what in the heck I got going on right now but I think yeah I think you're gonna like it I'm gonna do my first unboxing video today I've seen everybody else kind of do it just absolutely crazy ways you know figure my first unboxing better do it right so uh, I'm not gonna not gonna sit here and talk anymore I'm gonna get straight into it I need a little well, eye protection from this one. All right. <laughs> you get it? You get it? All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got going in here. Let's see. Oh, oh, I think I know what this is going to be. I started off with a, um, got a fresh hat. Fresh hat from Overcast Lure Co. As you can tell, I'm sure you can probably guess what's going to be in the rest of this box. But yeah, we got the hat, so uh, I'm gonna immediately rock that one. But let's, uh, let's dive in. Let's see. Started off with my uh, my MVP bait of the year. Set this off to the side. We've got the pink finger banger. Kind of like a little mini spook, or a, I'm sorry, spook junior. But I mean, you can tell it's just got got a lot of noise to it. It's got real good deep, deep noise, and uh, it seems like that pink color. They really like that pink color. If y'all hadn't hadn't tried throwing a you know a finger banger, I definitely recommend it. This is my go-to top water bait right now. Like I mean, this thing. This bait has produced more fish for me this summer than probably any other bait I've got in my tackle box. And, I mean, I, there was days I was catching fish on this, you know, 12, 1 o'clock in the afternoon, I'm still throwing top water, still hanging the reds left and right on that. And there's just something about it that they, they want that bait right there. Let's see what we got next. Got a, uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, let's see. The old pink shrimp clucker, or clucking shrimp, I'm sorry. This is one of his newer baits. It's a um, very, very weird top water. It's just, um, you see, it's got a, it's got a real interesting shape to it. Um, let's mimic a shrimp on the top water, but see, it's kind of got a, it's got a dog, you know, works a dog walking pattern. But if you notice, right up front, it's got a little popper, and so as you're walking the dog, you know, it kind of pops. And I'm gonna be honest, it's got a really crazy action. It takes, it took me, you know, a few trips to kind of get used to how to work it. But once you get get to that that cadence right and everything, this bait, I mean, it's right here behind the pink pink uh, pink finger banger. I mean, this is number one, number two baits for me right here. I got uh, I gave old Bill Walsh one of these a few months ago, and I mean, he fell in love with it instantly. I think anybody that tries this bait has has liked it. I mean, it is just it kills the redfish, kills the trout. I mean, everything just eats it up. I'm talking. They're hungry for this one. Hungry for this one. Let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah. This is a new one for me. It's, um, it's another finger banger, but it's in the baby red color. I haven't tried this color yet. Um, I know a lot of guys are throwing this in Louisiana, and they are killing the redfish on this. It seems, I don't know if it's kind of like a predatory thing, you know, they're trying to eat the younger reds so there's less competition for them, but the big redfish love this bait. I mean, they absolutely destroy it from what I've seen. I'm going to try throwing this next time I go out, see if I can't get any look, any, uh, any snips on it, a couple hookups, but I mean, look at that, it's just a... That's a great looking bait. And you know, these these overcast lures are all hand painted, uh, made by a guy named Zach Bro over there in Louisiana. Big shout out to Zach for these baits. Um, I mean, these are some of the best baits, I've, best top waters I've ever used. And I mean, it's just, you can see the quality of them. I mean, you know, he, he puts a great coat on every one of them, great colors to them. Just a great, great, great lure. 
And uh, so, I mean, if you're looking to get some good, good quality top waters, I would definitely recommend looking at. I think I got, I think I got one more in here for y'all. Let's see what else we got in here. This is the one I was wanting. I was really hoping I would get this one. The Hogzilla. This is one of his new baits. Uh, I'm, I think it's on the website. I'm not 100% sure that it's on the website yet, but. I mean, he's got a new bait, new color, uh, new color pattern on it, and everything. It's just, it's an awesome bait. It looks uh, it's real close to, I would, I would say like a little uh, Sheep Up Junior or something, you know. But it's just got a deep, deep, deep knock to it. And you know, it's uh, three inches long. You can see it's, you know, about the size of my palm. So it's a good small bait. That that should cover, be able to cover just about everything between trout, redfish. I mean, everything's gonna want to get a piece of this, so we'll see what we can do with it. I'm I'm really excited to throw this bait. I mean, it's just a, a good looking bait. Great, great looking. And this one, this one might beat out the the uh, banger banger. It's my new favorite. I'm really, really digging that new color. But yeah, you know if y'all are in the market to get some top water baits, highly recommend overcast top waters not not just because you know i'm pro staff with them but i mean they honestly i was throwing these long before i got on on uh, pro staff with them i mean these are just these are some quality quality baits i mean they hold up you know you think in their hand pen you're like oh man you know i'm gonna catch a few fish on them to get scratched up that hand paint doesn't really matter but i i can tell you I don't, I don't have my baits with me but i've got one that i have thrown for about a year and a half now but the paint paint looks brand new on it so i mean if you're if you're looking to get some top waters definitely definitely suggest looking at uh rover cast his own uh small business out of louisiana cut you cut you some uh some great lures out for you um this is my about the only top water i'll throw nowadays but yeah so if y'all are you know looking to check them out um, i'll drop the link below i'll drop the link for each of these lures below uh the website everything if you want to get a hold of these you know, I would definitely tell you, don't hesitate, get them while you can. Um, if you have any questions about them, you know, if you're curious about more information about them, shoot me a message, let me know. Um, I'd be happy to answer any questions you got for them. Stay tuned, because I'm going to do, uh, do a review just on this new hog villain, just specifically. So that'll probably be up in the next week or two. Y'all yeah, stay tuned for that one, but it's, uh, I'm excited for this one. I'm excited. But, you know, appreciate y'all watching, uh, tuning in. Uh, you know, it's kind of a short video, not not my normal deal. No fish to be caught in this one, but still, still pretty good. Um, you know, it's kind of branching out a little bit, trying to add a little bit of more middle, uh, add a little variety, maybe. add a little variety you know, to my channel. So, you know, you know, if you guys like this unboxing video, if you want to see more, if you want to see me whip out the old, Yo, it's all some more. Drop a comment below. Let me know you enjoyed it. Shoot me a thumbs up, you know. And uh, make sure you're subscribed up to my giveaway coming up. I got, I need 48 more followers. That's all we need, 48 followers. And I'm going to randomly pick one of my subscribers. Going to get over $100 worth of fishing tackle. You know, you'll get a few of these uh, overcast lures are in the in the giveaway. You know, I got, I know, I know for sure I've got one shrimp clucker in there. So you definitely don't want to miss that giveaway. But, uh, yeah. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.